We're slowing the aging process. New research out today says it can be an additional benefit linked to hormone replacement therapy. Health reporter Stephanie Saul joins us to explain these mm. new findings. Out today, guys, this study found that postmenopausal women who took hormone therapy were biologically younger compared to people who never used HRT. Hi, Caroline. Hi, Dr. Lazarus. Dr. Nareem Lazarus knows the benefits of HRT, hormone replacement therapy, personally and for her patients. It makes a world of difference. Carolyn O'Malley, who's 76, has been taking HRT that includes estrogen for 10 years. It pretty much changed my life. HRT is prescribed to treat the symptoms of menopause, including things like night sweats, gaining weight, moodiness, and insomnia. Now, a sweeping new study says it can also slow aging. I think that's like amazing. The new research covered 117,000 women in the okay. UK yep. who took hormone therapy after menopause. They were biologically younger and had a lower risk of death. The biologic age is the, the actual cells in your body and how they're aging versus your chronological age by calendar years. So this means that it helps women look younger and live longer? Correct. Correct. Amazing, right? Dr. Lazarus, who heads Exuberin at Virtua Health, says there's now mounting evidence that estrogen can slow the aging process, but it had a bad reputation for a while. Hormone replacement therapy fell out of favor after a 2002 study that linked it to strokes, blood clots, and breast cancer. Over the last 20 or 30 years, we've debunked that in many different studies now. After seeing the benefits of HRT in her patients, Dr. Lazarus, who's 54, is also on it. The uh, amazing difference in uh, the hot flashes and night sweats, I mean, quickly went away. But all the secondary symptoms, I'm finding I have more energy. I like my husband more. <laughs> I sleep, <laughs> right? While a proponent, Dr. Lazarus says some women shouldn't take HRT, including those with a history of heart disease and breast cancer. Now, doctors say there were some limitations with this new research published today by JAMA. That was this morning, and more studies are needed. Lots of women might have questions about this. Advise to talk to your doctors. And the promising. doctor's using it. That's all yes, right. and How she's using it and yeah. likes it a lot. How about and it? Potential options, which, yes. which are good. Thank you. Steph. Thanks, Steph. Appreciate it.